What's going on Claw fam? Today I'm bringing you another arcade review. Um, I haven't done one in a while and I want to get back into it. So this one's going to be on Trap Door. A lot of you guys are curious on what goes on inside the machine, if it's rigged, if it has payout settings and um, a bunch of other stuff. So I'm going to be sharing my personal opinion of it first off and I think it's a fantastic machine. It's very eye-popping it's got that wow factor to it with all the lights and it's an amazing looking machine it's huge and it's one of my biggest machines and uh, i'm not gonna lie it's not my most popular machine just because i've had it for a while and i do have a lot of cranes so it does add a variety to the plush crane um arcade game but for right now it's kind of like uh competing with those if you want to say but it besides that it's it is a great machine it does have settings to where you can make it rigged basically and a lot of you guys are wondering if it's rigged because the light goes around so fast it is very hard to tell if it's skipping or not and the answer to that is yes um there is a difficult setting it is called the jackpot window and that basically says how hard you want it to be to hit the jackpot and that can be there's not a certain amount of tries but there is a difficulty setting it's usually stuffed animals so most times it's not going to be too rigged but it can be so you want to look out for that and there's also something called trapdoor increments where even let's say if you get it on three cranks it won't matter if it's on the lowest increment because it will barely open up so you want to make sure that um, you, that it's opening up even when you get it on the yellow just in case you can't get it on the red So if you guys don't know how to play the game uh, Most of you do but you try to stop it on the red light there um, If not if you get on the yellow or purple It'll open up just a little bit more and you kind of keep getting it on the yellow or purple until you, you the prize drops or you hit it on the red with the instant win. so it's a it's a really um uh, it's a really cool game. I recommend playing it if you guys ever see it at the arcade. They are kind of hard to find. They are rare. And right now I'm actually messing with the settings, uh, the volume level. You can mess with uh, the price to play and then all the other payout settings and all that. So um, it's a fantastic game. And I'm also going to give you guys a look on the coin box um, just to show you where all the money falls and stuff like that. Um, with the card swipers, you won't really, these don't really need to open up. It's all in the card basically. But uh, yeah, this is where all the tokens fall. It's pretty mediocre where the money is. Um, nothing special about it. But uh, I think it's always exciting, kind of. Most people don't get to see what's inside. So I thought I'd show you guys. But that's about it. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you leave a like down below and comment what arcade game you want me to review next, and I'll uh, see you guys next week. Thanks for watching.